today I am going to be doing, I need to grab it, my Pipsy Bag unboxing, unbagging. Sorry about my appearance. I am currently doing a tutorial for you, or actually redoing a tutorial for you, and it requires for me to sleep on my hair. So I'm doing a video in the meantime because I get really excited about you guys, and you guys have been getting me such awesome feedback and support, and I miss that, and I miss you guys, and I miss being in your lives, and chit-chatting with ya so yeah people get annoyed that my ipsy videos are long and my unboxings are long and I'm like you are not one of my people okay you be you if you don't want this to be chit chatty go watch another ipsy one um but this is gonna be chit chatty because I like to talk to my spoomies okay uh and it is I, I'm not even gonna tell you what time it is but anyways so this one is Greetings from Destination Chic by Ipsy. Um, I thought it would have like a month or something. I will put the month in the description box. How about that? This is how these um, boxings have been going lately. So it came in this cute little bag. Um, it has like all sorts of so graceful. Uh, it has all sorts of landmarks and historical places. Hey, there's the Statue of Liberty. I think that's Big Ben. There's the Eiffel Tower. I know some things. Not really because I'm geographically impaired. Uh, this is cool because usually it's just a zip top and this time they did a little clipper clip and I like that they changed it up a little bit okay so my first item is uh, there's the front of it. it took me a little while is Shia 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 Chia 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 you remember those things that were you would water them you put seeds on them and then you would water them and they would grow out my parents would never get me one of those. I wonder why. Like, did they think I was going to, like, eat the seeds or something? I don't know why they wouldn't have got me something cool like that. Maybe I was too young for them? Maybe my brother had one? I don't know. But I feel like I should have gotten one. I feel suddenly ripped off. Uh, this is smoothing oil for your hair. It's rich in vitamins. I mean, if you guys care about this stuff, just look it up. I feel like... Okay. Okay. I feel like now I've already started and it's like, oh, what's the ending of this story? Um, antioxidants, proteins, and 18 amino acids. So I don't really like stuff like this. I like my hair to just be a little natural, but um, I do like smoothing oils uh, because they don't feel as invasive on my hair. I don't really like to feel anything on my hair. Uh, and it comes in this really pretty, it's a really pretty presentation, a bottle and everything. So it's kind of like the face lotion with this little drippy drip and I'm sure you just put it on your hands and then just kind of smooth your hair out. Um, have you guys been reading any cool books lately? I just started reading a new Sarah J. Moss, Mass book. Uh, she did the, uh, uh Throne of Glass series, which was amazing, so you should watch it, and you should be on, I won't tell anything, tell you guys, but you should just be Team Kale, that's all I'm saying. There are teams, and I am Team Kale, so if you're not that, I don't appreciate you. No, my sister is, so. Okay, so the next item, which I super always get excited about because these are always so cute. And the last three Ipsy bags, I think, I've gotten brushes, which are freaking awesome. Uh, otherwise, I just have a bunch of black brushes. And this one has little wheelies on it. It's so cute. Look how cute they are. But anyways, that's not really important. But uh, it feels really nice. I have to do the eye test because if I do it on my hand, I don't know. My eyes are a lot more sensitive. 
it feels really great. This is the kind of brush that I would use to blend out my crease and possibly just put, I would probably use it on my entire lid and blending out the crease. So I really like this. This is a hell's yeah, two thumbs up. I really, 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 really like this. And it's from Glamour Dolls. It's brush number 10. Anytime I get a brush in one of my packages, these cost $10, people. $10. So brushes are generally more, $10 or more. So if you get a brush in a bag, plus a pretty bag, and then maybe some other things in here you like, that's way worth your money. So anyways, again, I sound like I'm selling it to you and I have nothing to gain or, and I don't work for them. So, <laughs> Uh, but I just get really excited about things. So the next thing is this natural mineral coconut eyeshadow trio. I, don't, I feel like they're just throwing words in there like to be cool or something. I don't even know. But why is coconut? What does that have to do with anything really? It's just it's cool right now. I mean, I like coconut. So this is Pacifica, which is not like most amazing brand but it's a good brand um, it's 100% vegan and cruelty free which all makeup should be at this point I feel like that should just be like a given um, and the colors so this one is skinny dip crush skinny dip crush and lovely are the three different colors okay if I could get this open Oh, so this is really pretty. It seems kind of dull in this these lights. I don't have my studio light on, so it kind of seems like dull, but um, they're a little bit glimmery. There's one that is really pretty for a crease or something. The super dark color is um, not crease. I meant like a highlight underneath the eyebrow. I don't know why I say crease. Just realized because this would be a wonderful crease color. Um, they have, wow, amazing color payoff. I really did not put a lot on my fingers. So that was incredible. And I didn't have to like brush hard or anything. So I wish that it didn't just look like chocolate it's so much prettier. Maybe I'll have to do a picture or something. It's like this very glittery gold brown. And on my camera, it's just like, whoa, look at her veins. And then the third color is an in-between color that, oh, it's a much lighter. It's very gold. Again, it's like, wow, look at that lady's veins. But, uh, let me see the payoff of this. Yeah, that's really pretty. I just put like a little tiny bit of this. So, I like when they do these that are all in the same kind of color range because you can just put this in your purse or just take this out and use this for your entire lid. You can do the this brown on your lid you can do this in your crease and then you can do this on the inner eyelid and under your brow and it would look beautiful so that's my opinion of that okay next item smashbox x-rated mascara voluminator i am really into mascara if you have not watched my channel before so can you all read that i think you can so it's pretty simple packaging. I think this is a tester size, so there's not much written on it. But let's take a look. See, I know I shouldn't open these, but I'll probably end up using this. I like nice fluffy brushes like this. It looks like it could get a little bit clumpy, so I'd just be like a little bit more careful uh, with it. But it is a nice big brush, and I like that. So I'll probably end up liking this. It's not probably gonna be my favorite thing in the whole world but I really do like this these are awesome things to give away as well so 
anytime one of my friends needs a mascara or something, I'm like, let me open my drawer full of things because I haven't worn makeup in so long. Uh, okay, so this next and last item is Hanalee Lip Treatment. And there's not much said about it other than that. Literally no instructions and that's all it says. It just says not for sale. I might have to look this up on the internet which annoys me. But my lips have been awful so I might give this a try and pray that it doesn't make things worse because a lot of lip treatments make your lips worse for some reason. I don't know if you guys have had that happen to you in the comments down below if you have had that happen to you let me know and let me know what, what lip treatment or chapstick or whatever you use um, because I want to steer clear of them but yeah I feel like that's happened a lot but my lips have been really awful and I have this anxiety thing where I rip off the skin on my lips so I would love to have some sort of treatment that kind of just even out my skin I don't know why now that summer my lips decide to be chapped makes absolutely no sense but hey so I guess I'm gonna have to look this up online because there's nothing said about it and I kind of want to know a little bit about it before I put it on my lips somewhere that's near going into my body so those are all my things I am very happy and I'm very pleased uh, I liked I really liked everything um, except for I don't really like hair products but if I am gonna have a hair product I would like something like this more than like a shampoo and conditioner or something like that because I like to use my own stuff for that uh, so all in all it was a great bag I love Ipsy so I usually like all of their bags and pretty much like the stuff that they give me um, do I think it was worth ten dollars this month absolutely two thumbs up I do and the only thing I didn't like was, well, I don't know if I don't like it. It's just the lip treatment that I have to like look into it to actually know how do I use this? What it, what are, what are you? I mean, other than a lip treatment. And um, so that might be like a future thing where I'm talking about that like crazy and I'm like, I love this so much. Or it might be something that I just throw away immediately. But ingredients usually are generally a good thing. I know a lot of people on my YouTube channel have a lot of allergies. So, yeah, just a weird situation all around. So, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Sorry to keep looking at the time. Uh, I just know that you guys like, well, my YouTube channel people like me to chit chat with you guys a lot. But um, people that are just watching this to see what's inside my bag don't like this. So,. I like you guys on my channel so and if you would like to join my world please subscribe and that would make me very happy and if you would like me to continue doing these unbagging unboxing type things let me know because I don't know if I will continue getting them unless you guys are really really liking them uh, I probably will get them I'm just saying just let me know if you like them and down in the box, please answer all the questions that I asked in this video or one of them or say hi. Uh, I just appreciate you guys so, so much. And I hope you guys are having a pain-free, stress-free day. And I'm sending out X double O's. And I will talk to you soon with the rest of this tutorial. And you will figure out what I'm doing. So it's kind of like a little teaser. Yay! Alright, I'll talk to you guys soon. Bye. Mwah.